All right, brothers, sisters, so I'm in my laboratory working on this gateway here. Um, Orion's Gate, and I hear a lot of people talking about, um, I'm sorry, Orion's Gate, Lion's Gate. I hear a lot of people talking about Lion's Gate. Lion's Gate was actually, was an actual gateway. It wasn't like, I mean, the gateway now, what they're talking about is the gateway now is not what it's supposed to be. It's just like almost something like Christmas. Christmas is here, you know, according to when these beings say it's here. Our ancestors were astrologers, astronomers. They were space travelers. They were a little bit everything. All right. When you talk about the Lions Gate, this is what happened. And we've got to go back in history. And the only way you can find out is you got to go back in history. All right. This is when um, certain galaxies, like the Sirius Galaxy, and I'm not sure if it was the Sirius A or Sirius B, but the Sirius Galaxy, because you got two Sirius Galaxies. You got the Sirius A, you got the Sirius B Galaxy. Ooh. Excuse me. Our ancestors had the telescopes to see that far. All right. We had technology. All right. The Sirius A or one of the Sirius galaxies. And you had the Leo galaxy and you had the Orion's belt were in alignment with each other. And our planet was in alignment with those uh, galaxies as well. And some long, 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 long time ago, our ancestors actually created a gateway or a portal. And that was like this extremely powerful energy that came through. And it was like this once in a lifetime thing. And it was written in history. I mean, this, this these Saxons have our history. It was written in history and it was recorded. And this powerful energy came through and the brothers and sisters were able to manifest things just like that. It was a powerful energy, but they had actually created a gateway. It was an actual gateway. It wasn't just something that happened because what you got to understand, understand, overstand is when you're talking about planets, when you talk about galaxies, talk about star systems, these are all powerful, extremely powerful um, uh, areas of condensed energy. Each galaxy is like an area of condensed energy. So these energies were in alignment with each other and they were in alignment with our planet Chi. So what our ancestors did, they saw that there was coming, this was coming and they, they created a gateway and they opened that and, and, and as soon as they created that gateway, all right, and well, I can, I'm not gonna say as soon as they created, they created the gateway because they knew that it was coming and the gateway had to be at, at, at a certain angle where it would catch the energy. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to explain to you guys how it, the things go because I had to go into meditation on this. The gateway had to be at a certain angle where it would catch this energy. All right. And it came all over the, the this, this realm, all over the planet. I mean, it was like all over this realm and brothers and sisters were literally in a state of what you call ultra supreme power. And that's that lion's gate. But it was an actual gateway that was built, that was created and that had brought in that massive energy. This is why we talk about building and creating gateways. You got to understand, understand, overstand, brothers and sisters. You building the gateways help to bring in certain things. All right. So the whole Lion's Gate thing was an actual gateway that was built. And like we said, just like you look at the Dogon, Dogon be like, they'd be like, how does the Dogon know this? Because you know, they were taught this. This is something that was passed down to them. But our ancient, ancient ancestors 
at one point they literally they they were in alignment. They we you think telescopes are new? I mean they're not. You know, you think you think all this stuff no it's not. You think probes going out into space is new? No, it's not. We sent probes out of space. That's the reason why these inorganic beings are sending them out because because they're trying to be what we were. We just forgot who we were. But the whole thing about this Lions Gate was that we created a gateway, and you had Sirius. I don't know which galaxy. I don't know if it's Sirius, Sirius A or Sirius B. The Orion's Belt. The Leo galaxy, because the Leo galaxy, the Sirius galaxy, Orion's belt, the Orion's belt, all right, three powerful galaxies, and they were all in alignment with our planet. And our ancestors saw that alignment coming in places. They peeked out into the great frontier and they created this gateway. They created a gateway. And as soon as they created this gateway and it was all done and it was all fashioned the right way, it had all the sigils, you know, sigils, all those ancient markings had all the sigils on there that represented whatever they it needed to be represented. That energy came through that gateway and charged everybody's body up. And therefore. It was recorded, like I say, it was recorded. This was a lion's gateway. It was an actual gateway. It's just not something that just comes out there. But these inorganic beings, they want to feel powerful. They say, oh, yeah, you know, this, this, is this, this. This is why it's important to be in tuned. You know, it's important to be in tuned to the cosmos. It's important to be in tuned to the galaxy. It's important to be in tune with nature, with your universe, with your star system, with your planet, with yourself. With all the universes around. How did I know? All the things that we talked about. Because I'm in tune. I stay in tune. You know? I stay in tune. You know, I don't, I don't have time for all this other whatever. You know, I was listening to sis, uh, little sister Conja Queen. And, and uh, that little sister, she's on point. She's on point. Just like she said. She says, how is it that, how is it that they tell us that Lion's Gate portal or the Lion's Gateway, how is it that they just give us a date? It's important, brothers and sisters, that we be in tune. All right? It's important that you be in tune. This Sister Conjure Queen was absolutely right. It's abs- absolutely right. How is it that they're going to tell us when this gateway is going to open? I don't know if this was a one-time thing that happened. Or if this keeps going around the same thing over and over and over again because there are a lot of things that are happening in the in the in the cosmos in our universe and our galaxies has never happened before but these inorganic beings want things to happen over and over and over and over and over again they're talking about alliance gateway what else is really going on there's something else that's going on that we don't know about something for you to think about all right Something for you to think about but the Lions Gateway the original Lions Gateway was when our ancestors were peering into the great frontier what they call space the great frontier and they saw these galaxies coming in alignment and they saw that our planet or our realm was coming in alignment with it and they created a gateway they opened they created a portal and when they created this portal, that when everything came in alignment, it was like a blue. All right. But, 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 you know, it's like they had the the portal, the way they created the portal, the way they built it, it had to be at a certain angle where it was in alignment with these uh, powerful forces up in space, these galaxies. These energy, these condensed energies, powerful condensed uh, energy sources, because all, all of them are energies. All right. And that's that's the whole point of the Lion's Gateway. It was an actual gateway that was built. 
It's just not something that, oh, yeah, I'm, let me sit in meditation and, and I want to manifest things. And, and, you know, first thing the brothers and sisters want to do is I want to get money. I want to get cars. I want to get clothes. I want to get shoes. First thing they start thinking about a physical, but our brothers and sisters were not thinking on the physical. Our ancestors were not thinking on the physical level. They were thinking on other levels. I mean, they were thinking on physical, but they they were looking at more intelligence. They were looking at at at, at a higher uh, 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 spiritual mindset. I mean, they this is this is what they were looking at because they didn't have all this confusion that's going on right now at this present moment. Like we say, our ancestors didn't have all that bullshit. But that's what the Lion's Gateway is all about. The real Lion's Gateway. It was an actual gateway that was built. That literally brought in that energy from those powerful um, energy sources, these galaxies. Sirius Galaxy, I don't know if it was Sirius A or Sirius B or could have been both the Sirius Galaxies. All right. There is a Sirius C, but it's a bit far distant than Sirius A and B. Um, and you had the Leo galaxy. Then you had the uh, Orion's belt. You have our planet. And basically everything was in alignment. And like I said, they actually built a gateway. They built a gateway. All right. It wasn't something that they just sat and meditated and, oh, we're going to sit and meditate. No, 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 no. They actually built a gateway. (laughs) They actually built a real gateway. And that gateway that built pulled in this powerful supreme energy. And it brought a lot of things that was necessary in their time. You know, they wanted more intelligence. They want to know how to create this. They want to know how to create that, how to do this right here, how to do that there. Higher spiritual concept, you know, higher, higher sorcery, higher, you know, I mean, this is and and things manifested. That was a time on our realm where the things had literally manifested for all the brothers and sisters and they spread all across the world. Or all across our planet. All right. So the Lion's Gateway was an actual gateway that was built and not just um, something that was said. It was an actual gateway. This is why we are continually telling you all, brothers and sisters, you got to build. You got to open up your mind. You got to see past the lies. You know, just like we talk about Christmas and, uh, um, and Easter and Halloween, you know, all those different holidays were based on ancient um, energies. And wh- what do we do? We we built gateways. We built portals. Some of us could actually go into other realms and other, other galaxies, you know, walk through it and, and, and come into a whole new life, come back and, and powers and energies that you could never imagine. This is what our ancestors were looking for. They were looking for powers. They didn't they weren't fighting over gold and silver and all this stuff here. They were looking for a higher, a higher level of consciousness, higher level of intelligence. And we being who we are, we're condensed sunlight, condensed energy. Our bodies have the ability to consume the highest level of cosmic energy and it will not dissipate. We will begin to transform and to other, uh, 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 I, I can say like this, transform into otherworldly beings. Let's just say it that way. We begin to transform into, transform into otherworldly beings, which means that we have the ability to evolve. So something happened during that time and our brothers and sisters, our ancestors had evolved. It was a point of evolution where they evolved into a higher mindset. A higher form of body, a higher energy, a higher intelligence. And therefore, it was recorded. It was recorded. All right. Just want to share that with y'all. All All right. This is why we always telling you guys, you got to build. 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 Anyone, you know, someone say, oh, yo, you know, our body is a spaceship. Guess what? Yeah. Okay. Your body is a spaceship. 
But guess what? We built spaceships to put these spaceships in. So these spaceships can fly through space. All right. There's a lot of brothers and sisters who are on this lazy path and don't want to do shit and want to make up excuses. And then when shit starts to go um, 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 uh, uh, powerful, th things start to turn powerful for other brothers and sisters, they're going to be sitting back telling me, so, well, you know, maybe I can manifest this. No, no, no. You got to build. You got to create. We built portals and gateways and stargates. This is what we were building. We this is how we were able to 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 achieve such higher levels of intelligence because we were constantly building different things that brought energies to us. Yes, we were invaded a few years ago. Some I say a few years ago. You know, the past, the present, and the future are all in one. Yes, they they destroyed our our source of power. But guess what? We can restore that source of power, but we got to build. The Lion's Gateway was an actual gateway that was built. It was constructed by our ancestors. And extremely, extremely high powers and extremely high energies came through those gateways and charges up. Y'all got to get y'all got to get yourself together. Seriously. Really, y'all got to get yourself together because, you know, a lot of y'all just I don't know. I don't know. I'll be I'll be reading y'all spirits. I know there are some of, of you all who are older and you can't. But there are you all who are younger and you can, but you refuse to. That's the difference. That's the difference. OK, so let's get to um, let's get to creating brothers and sisters. All right. Catch you guys later.